Okay, I see the bloopy, but there's like a boat over here? No. I mean, I saw the little, uh, leaf things for some reason. I thought that was a boat. And, like always, the best way to deal with that is just with a rocket. I do have 30 rockets, it's not too bad. And it doesn't really matter which way it's pointed, because it just it has enough power to completely dislodge. Uh, I don't know what you're, if you're supposed to do something else. Because there's, there's never, like, rockets around when I do that. It makes me think I'm doing the wrong thing. Oh, there we go. Hit you. Where are you heading? Over there. So not that way. Where does this go, then? Oh, we'll have to figure it out after we've gone through this cave. Ah. Fine. Heat armor it is. Oh, that killed you. That's nice. Very convenient. Oh, it's just a blue one. I'm surprised I hit the headshot. <laughs> Makes things simpler, though. Okay, well, I guess I just... Well, I'm not gonna bust through it on my own. You're gonna just do most of the heavy lifting. I mean, that's what I would like, because I can't, I can't exactly shoot a bomb arrow. Really? You are very convenient. And free. Don't take any durability doing this. Just a little bit of extra time. Here we are. It's a chest. A Zonite chest. That is interesting. What's in it? Fine. Hello? Yeah. Goodbye? Yeah. That's not what I meant to do, but that's fine. Oh, ooh! Sapphire. There's another- there's an opal over there as well. I'll get it in a second. Two opals. God, are we through yet? Come on! How much further is it? Oh, we got through one of the sides. Where'd the other one go? Wait. You can also break these? I didn't know that. Okay, I can waste an arrow for that. That's fine. Arrows are cheap. Yeah, if all I have to do is just do some little bit of lightning. It's so convenient. I accidentally trick. Oh, like you hit some other random nonsense. I, I always randomly uh, select her by accident, anyways. Oh my gosh, it's still going in two directions. I think it's only in two directions, that is. Yeah, it's going deep enough that I'm confident about that. It's not the first time I've uh, You go that way. And you, I guess, can go that way. Oh my gosh, it just keeps going. Okay, we made it through probably to the first cave. Yep, okay. Riju, where'd you go? Come this way. Ah, here we are. Ooh. Now that complicates things. What was the other cave for, then? Okay, 
Okay, you probably want me to go through this, right? Follow a beam to its end and off the crystal there. Yeah, I understand. But the beam goes that way. Yes. Can I see it? No. Why can't I see it? Is it not in here? But if it's not in here, what's the point of this big room? It's pointing just past that... Basically at that wall. I think there's a cave back behind the lava. Okay, I'm gonna come back, because there's the other direction that we didn't go to. And that probably has the Google Frog. Yeah. <laughs> Should have seen you up there. There we go. Ha. Need a big one. Good enough, you can shut off. Just kind of spun around in this circle and it did it. That was pretty convenient. Uh, so we have one fan. That's hopefully going to be enough. And no way to course correct. So we should go for the island first, in that case. That way if I do mess up, uh, at least hit some actual land and not a lava fall. Nothing here. That's fine. This is not a giant talus. That would have been problematic. Oh, I really could have just gone gone in this direction. I can definitely see the land now. All right, here we are. I'm not going to take the machine with me. Whatever, <laughs> if you call it a machine, that is the little platform. I shouldn't need it. Aha. Nice and easy. Is there anything else around? Doesn't look like it's... <laughs> you who offers the crystal, I'll grant you a light that banishes evil. Yeah, these crystal sh shrines are fine little annoying. At least it's a reward shrine at the end. I think it is at least. Pretty sure every time it is. I haven't been paying that much attention to all of them, but when I have, it has been, if memory serves. Makes it so they're not complete wastes of time, because you don't actually have to do a puzzle afterwards. Just a puzzle on the surface, which basically negates the annoyance of it. Not entirely, of course. Aha. Yeah, I'll just skip it. Whatever. <laughs> Grab this. Uh. Sure, I'll drop that shield. So, I have more shields than I ever need at a time. It's crazy. You really don't need sh many shields. <laughs> That's why I've been, oh, every time, been upgrading bows or mostly wet swords, normal weapons. Because I go through those way more often. Like bows I have enough as well. It's mostly regular weapons, so I have more options about what to break first. Alright, what's above us? Ooh. Is there... Hmm. Oh, I can climb these shrines. It's, it was the ones in Breath of the Wild that you can climb. That works. Ooh, hello. I'll take that. Oh, that was a lot of stuff. Nice. That makes sense. No, not... Ooh, that was close. 
Actually, it doesn't matter. I'm. See, like I'm, I'm not in a fiery area. Hmm. These things are always are still kind of annoying to get. What they do with. Even, it's mostly it's just kind of shoot them with bomb arrows until they go down. It wasn't too bad actually. Hello? Oh, there you are. Yeah, you're kind of a joke. Don't mind if I just completely ignore you. And the fact that I'm taking gloom damage. Yeah, go ahead and break it. That's fine. But I have this response. And it's 50 space or 40 damage. Okay, so maybe not as good. Where'd the bow just go? No, it's right here. I really want it. It is so good. Uh, well, I guess I should mark that this is here. Close enough. Ooh, that's a lot of topaz. Okay. Two very nice gems in a row. Okay, so that's where I was... This is the area I was wondering where it led, isn't it? So I've seen down there, that's where the cave entrance was. I can't believe the Master Sword's already back. That was fast. Feels fast, at least. Oh, so this is, like, the main path you're supposed to take in, like, Breath of the Wild. Okay, there's something down here. But let's go along this path for a bit. Ah, and this is as far as you can take a horse in Breath of the Wild. Yeah. I sort of remember this. So... It would be now that we'd start being on fire, like, or shortly after this point, that you'd start to be on fire all the time. Oh, nice. Oh, is this a Korok? It is. Hello. Don't find me. I just want your seed. That was fairly short. Okay. Only a few. Yeah. Had much more annoying ones. And... Oh, I have to fight this guy, don't I? You're right here. Exactly, I think, ish, where you were in Breath of the Wild. So unless this is not one and it's a... Yeah. It's not a bait. Back. Uh, go for Talus Killer? Not yet. Not until I made it super strong by taking your heart. That was... Oh, and the one the weapon I'm going to be using after this is going to be even stronger. Ooh, lots of rubies. Nice. But yeah, let's let's go ahead and just use that. 65. Yeah, that's how I'm gonna be killing Talus for the foreseeable future. I'm surprised how few caves there are in Death Mountain. Especially when I was uh, told that people were you know, all those people saying that there's lots more caves opened up because of the lava retracting. Or receding. Oh, not one of you. Uh... Yeah, yeah. I'm not scared of you. Not if you're a flame one. Like, can't, don't you know I can't get be caught on fire? There we go. I guess I'll take your ruby sword. It does have a ruby on it. 
Uh, but mostly I stopped because I saw the luminous rocks right here. How, how stupid would I have looked if those weren't luminous rocks? Luminous stones. But they are. Still no caves in this area. I mean, there's a cave underneath us, which is the restaurant cave. Okay, I'm going to be heading back to that area where... Ooh, hello. Let me turn all of you guys off. Take the shield. Wait, it's still a rusty shield. What did you do to it? What? You're supposed to de-rust objects. At least that's how it worked in Breath of the Wild. Take it. Do it. Do your job. Okay, that did nothing. So why does... Why does it work sometimes? Like... Here, take this gloom spear. What? Nothing. Ow. I should have expected that. What about this traveler's sword? Come on, try again. You did it once. What? Does it only work on shields? What, what other shield can I drop? Uh, like, here's... It's because I, I took damage right there. Here, here's a muddy zonite shield. It's taken no damage. It has shield guard up plus nine. What are you doing? No, that shield does nothing. Is it only once per Octorok? I'm confused. Can I? No. Ooh, I can get your tails on. Good. Okay, somewhere around this lake, right here, is a cave with something about a full moon inside of it during the day. Hopefully we'll find a bloopy soon. Is this more luminous rock? I think so. Looks like it. Nice. How many, I need like 60. How much do I have? 60. <laughs> oh, well, isn't that convenient? <laughs> that was... <laughs> okay. Interesting. That looks like a cave. And that's where we'll be heading. I don't... Still haven't detected the bloopy, though. If there's not bloopies at every single cave, I'd be disappointed. Honestly, because that's how I've been <laughs> trying to find them. I mean, currently, that is. Yes, I do know there's another way I could be going about finding caves. I just haven't uh, gone to one of those yet. That was a Korok. Almost walked right past you. I mean, I did rock right past you, but I saw you out of the corner of my eye. You blended it very well. I'll give you that. Alright. Cave. Fake Verona Cave. Not currently on fire. I see. I understand the full moon thing now. I have to sit here and wait till noon. Well, if it's exactly noon, uh, well, I'm not going to sit here for that. Oh, here's a ruby sword. That's convenient. Sit here till noon. That's... Okay. Yes, we're world. looking for the moon. I know. Understand. <laughs> Aha. There we go. 
<laughs> that was weirdly on the weirdly thematic. Great timing for that. Okay. Any ways? This is a cave. Yeah, over here. Good. Break it. Oh, it was just a single level layer. It wasn't too bad. All these rocks to break. And then you! <laughs> nice! Keep getting these headshots. Very practical. Okay. Let's head to the southern mine. Uh, but first, since this is kind of on the way. So let's see how this place is different. Because it should be different. Welcome to Bedrock Bistro. Ours is the finest restaurant in Hyrule, specializing in gourmet roasts. I see. Whether you're a Goron or Hylian, I have every confidence you'll be sal salivating for more. If you're hankering for a steak, please order directly from the grill. Mm. Per se, I'm relieved you're a Hylian. Right now, rock roast is in short supply, and I don't have enough to keep <laughs> up with the demand of the Gorons. Ah. Can't go get supplies myself at the moment, so I'm a bit of a bind. And by that you mean... Is that a frozen one? I can't tell. And I can't get on here at all. Oh, I can. Still cooking on the flame, it's piping hot. If you say so. Hey, it's good to see you again. Aww. Thanks help, thanks again for your help when I was stuck in those ruins over in Farron. If you hadn't come by, I'd, be sh I'd sure be hungry by now. Ah. Anyway, after I'm that, I met up with my friends to wrap up all the Skyview Tower maintenance requests. We stayed in all sorts of places, but kept hearing about the incredible food at Bedrock Bistro. Our timing was perf the timing was perfect, so I had to come give it a try. Oh. Wow, I definitely recommend it. Can't wait to tell Sawson and Bilson how good it is. Ah. Sawson is a friend from work. We started climbing Death Mountain together. But he wanted to continue on up to the Goron Hot Split Springs, so we split up. Uh -huh. Told him there were plenty of hot springs around, but he wasn't having it. No, only the sp only special springs for him. Oh. Uh, who's Bilson? Ah. Bilson's friend from work. He's a real carpenter. If you're looking for him, keep an eye out for his headband. He's a picky eater, said he wasn't interested. Mm -hmm. He's a stubborn one. Even if he's starving, there's some things he won't eat. He flew off south, saying something about eating fish. Okay. I don't think we've actually been to the Goron Hot Springs. That's like the main path to Death Mountain. We did not take it. <laughs> that is an interesting way of going about it, I guess. Uh, anyways, I guess we're just going back to do the same quest we did last time, kind of. Might as well. Hopefully it's there, at least. Technically have no guarantee. Hmm. Aha, there's some. Good. They're back to normal. They only grabbed one, but I assume that's going to be enough. Well, here you go. Just floating there. Oh, sure, sir, that rock roast there. Could I have it? Give it to me, I'll whip you up our special dish. Wonderful. Thank you so much. To show my gratitude, here's a special dish I've dish I've missed. That's it? Mm. Don't have enough rock roast. Bring me in more and I'll whip you up something nice. Really? That's it? Okay. That's not really worth it. Well, I guess I got the quest complete, at least. Uh, I want to go... Straight forward. Let's go around. Wait, I have the minecart. I almost got on a horse. But we have minecarts here. And we're going to minecart land. This did not go very far. Anyways, we're here. <laughs> kind of. 
Oh, this is another- wait, this is another restaurant cave. Uh, go on with them. Southern Mine. I mean, there's stuff that- Bloopy? Why is there a Bloopy here? Is there a cave I never got- went to over around here? Goron's over here, so I assume I'm going the right way. Though, actually, no, this shouldn't be the right way. Oh, right! Right, right, I remember this. Uh, we'll come back for this. Uh, that was the, uh, lizard cave. I was told about it, but I didn't want to be bothered to make up more fireproof stuff. I completely forgot about it, to be fair. Anyway, we're looking for minecart land. Something about the southern mine. Lots of lizards here. It's another bloopy I got to, that it was got detected as well. Now it's the same direction. Minecart land. Yes. Where? There's this cave right here. Have I been in this cave? Is this a proper cave? It's right where I put the marker for some reason. Oh, I have a. This is a. This is a cave. Hello. Minecart land. Customer, we've had a customer here. You ready, little brothers? Here we go. From morning till morning. Smiles all the time. Hey, Kabata, what's your face doing? Get it together. Your face? What? Your face? Not from the customer, brothers. Less bickering, more smiling. Okay, let's take it from the top. Ready and from morning till morning. Smiles all the time. Welcome to Minecart Land. Where minecarts mean smiles. Ah. Brought to you by the one and only Uniboko. <laughs> Rules are simple. Oh. You ride a minecart down the track, popping as many targets as you can within a time limit. I see a balloon. You want to use arrows to pop the targets? Oh, and don't leave the cart or game's over. Pop five or more targets before the time runs out and you win. <laughs> Keep things fair, you'll be riding our dear old cart and no outside carts allowed. Put the cart on the track, get in, and start smiling. And to celebrate our grand opening, your first ride is free. We even give you ten arrows on the house. Mm. Better, your face, you're doing it again. You're gonna scare away the customer. Look at me, you gotta smile. Like this. Please don't mind them. Now it's time to hop in the cart. This is a self service kind of joint, so you'll be the one to put the cart on the tracks. Are you ready to roll? Let well, the game begin. Wait a second while the target oh, while I get all the targets set up. Here we go. Oh, I already missed two. I still missed that one. Whichever ones I can. Come on. Come on. I just needed five, technically, but we're gonna go for a perfect score. Okay, this bow does not shoot very far. I think that's my problem. <laughs> Need another bow. Uh, yep. Last target. Oh, no, it's not. Is that it? I hit 11. I feel like there should be maybe 12. Ooh. Let's 
time to announce results. Looks like you hit a total of 11 targets. Smile. Amazing, that makes you a winner. Oh no, I was so surprised I forgot to smile. He's a prize offered up by with the biggest of smiles. Yo. Smile styles room to grow. Look for you to prep a high speed course geared towards up and comers. Ranger has to come talk to me instead of my brother. I mean, if I'm going to be taking a. I need a better. Oh, I could go for a three shot bow. That might be good. Let's do it. The game's a little different from Bart Beige's. It's custom crafted for a slightly tougher challenge. So put your rapid fire shooting to the test. So, quick, fast response time you got there. Good stuff. Let's speed through the rules. Hop in the cart, roll down the track, and shoot seven targets as quick as you can. No getting out. Yeah, I understand. Within 120, you win. Yeah, yeah, I understand. Micro truck is going. So this round's free. I'll even throw in some arrows. Hop in minecart, go for some high speed throws. You ready for some speed? Now let's go. Get the targets ready. Time to roll. I don't need to hit all of them. That's fine. Ooh. Hit seven. That's game. Ah. Let's hear the results. Time this for this run was Ooh. 23 seconds. Oh. So fast. Fantastic. You cleared that course in the blink of an eye. And a second, I'm so stunned I forgot to smile for you. Ooh. Here's a prize. Happy face and all. Oh, a third one? Ah. You beat my brother, both my brother's courses. Incre pretty incredible, you know that? Watching you handle that minecart gave me an idea for a course of my own. I'm going to set it up. Ooh. At Death Mountain. In fact, I think I'll go set it up now. Come give it a try when you can. Ooh. I'm excited. Oh, it tells me where the Fierce Deity armor is. That's good. I only found one of them, technically. Uh, Skull's left eye. Yeah, I already did that one. <laughs> Probably. Stump an old Hyrule field. And then Kala's Citadel, which is fine as well. Uh, Hot Springs. Actually, do I want to do Hot Springs right now? Well, I'm here, so might as well. There's someone out and about here. That's what I heard. I'm talking to. So, yep, right there, I see you. I doubt this is for anything, but. Uh, sheer bliss. Good evening. Did you come to take a dip in the hot springs, too? Got a good stopping point with my work, so I plopped down here in the springs to restore myself. Ah. Ooh, we had pl heard plenty of good things about Goron Hot Springs. These were the guys who were setting up the towers, right? And I helped them? But there's no denying it's the best. My stiff, aching muscles are getting all loose and floppy thanks to the magic of these waters. If you, can, if you can't tell, I just love this place. Uh, air, okay. Hot areas. Oh. Elden are piping hot. Recently, Death Mountain calmed down, so the waters have cooled to a temperature that Hylians can enjoy. Oh. Some folks are having a rough time climbing up to Goron Hot Springs. There's always the springs located in front of the Bedrock Beast Trail. Those ones are relatively easier to get to. Oh yeah, Emerson said he'd be going to that restaurant. Ah. Uh, cold areas? Oh. Secret Springs and Hepper are up in the northwest are your best bet for something hot in someplace cold. Okay, but you're risking left trying if you tried going. It's Hot Street Fanatic, I'd love to go. Uh. But I've tried three times now and I've had to give up due to the inclement weather. I've also heard that on clear nights there's an extremely rare aurora phenomenon that sets in the sky a light. Ah. Really? I don't remember that. Well, there are quite a few springs to choose from. Ultimately, it's a cost-benefit analysis. How quickly and easily can you achieve contentment? 
That's what you've got to consider here. By that measure, Meta Mountain Secret Springs would be my top recommendation. This place called Taino Village to the south. Meta Mountain is on the road leading there. Really? Nothing more than a little detour to find it. Seeing here is a butte and the springs themselves perfection. Oh. Keep a secret from the rest of the world, will ya? Sorry, where is this? Meta Mountain. Secret Springs? I'll look into it. You don't see an often turn up this, or up turn up the Goran Hot Springs at this hour. It must be quite the hot spring connoisseur or something, traveler. Sure, sure, there are other hot springs boiling away in other places, but the hot water here is the best. Though it used to be a Simmerstone spr used to be Simmerstone Springs had the best water before the entrance collapsed. It's in the caves of Gorko Tunnel, southeast. Top secret, you see, you gotta be a Goran in the know to know about them. Water at those springs is the perfect temperature and goes real nice with all the steam in the caves. Can't ask anybody to go to Vixid and I can't clear it out myself, but this spring here is my favorite right now, so I guess I don't need the others. Okay, so hot spring does happen to be a good one. After all, you can take a soak while gazing at the Death Mound scenery. Uh, yeah, I understand. I was worried it might erupt again, but it seems to have calmed down. Talk about a relief. Secret Springs down here? Where I'm heading anyways. Okay. Well, where I wanted to head next, I mean. Because there was a cave that we were detecting for a bit. Down below. Yeah, I understand. It's right there. Hello. Ooh. Good thing I stopped by over here. Company store special. Yeah, I want all the rubies. <laughs> yep. Take my money. And you're selling flint? Why? Is it minecart land? Yeah, I know about it. Anytime and day. Anytime and any day, safety is the only way. Customer, welcome to you. Inboko finally finished building the long-awaited attraction, Minecart Land. Well, we're seeing the maintenance, so the safety's all up to snuff. Ah! You want to check it out? Just head on down this road. Once you see a sign that says Minecart Land, just go past it and then hang a left. Oh! Give yourself a merry old time, yeah? I kind of did already. Okay, there's a cave down this way. This person's pointing that way. There's you. Oh, I don't want to use this bow anymore. Not right now. It's a bit of a waste for if I'm for most things. Ooh, there's a lot of them at the entrance. That makes sense for why the guy is already wanting to go in here. Garanbi River Cave. Hello. Silver enemies take so long to kill. That's why I usually either cheese them or ignore them. Or wait for some very strong weapons. Because I don't always have super strong weapons on me. Ooh. Whoa, that's close. There's quite a lot of lava in here. It does come around from... It's coming from somewhere. That's very interesting. Hello there. Don't mind if I just completely destroy you. It goes down that way. Now that's probably the correct way to go. Or... Wait, why would you? there be a correct way and a not correct way? Unless Misko's treasure is also here. Here's the hoping. But this feels more like the, uh, uh, Boobble Frog way.
Yeah, there it is. Okay, and reverse. Oh, what the? Okay, that feel I feel like that shouldn't count. Ouch. That was on me. Alternatively, I can just grab it. Okay, well, that's not a very strong way to do it, but whatever. Go back down. Oh, that barely worked. Oh, there's nothing up here. can't really tell. It kind of looks like there should be something up there. Really? There's nothing? Oh, yeah. I guess so. Oh, well. I thought what I did was clever. Uh, oh, there's two of these stacked on top of each other. Uh, let me fix that. That should make them move a little bit better. And off we go. Can you push us any faster? No. Great. Okay, off. I mean, there's... No, back on so I can get up there easily. Ooh, what do I see there? That's nice. Exactly what I've wanted. Honestly, not a bad weapon. <laughs> not really. Uh, I'll drop that. Okay, final piece of the set that I really want. That's another door that I can open, maybe. Yay! Oh! Why did it open? It's only the second time there's been a random place like this that I've seen. Visitor from afar, should you thirst for treasure, remain unslaked. Read on. I discover the tunic of awakening in a strange land and have hidden it away. Solve my riddle for make it your own. On the Bantha frontier where Rain, Piper, and Tan Tanagar meet, ruined pillars stand together. One of these mighty pillars opens the way to my treasure. So my riddle find my treasure and earn my respect. Okay, so this is the Bantha frontier. Here's Piper, here's Rain. What was the other one? Rain, Piper, and Tanagar. And the canyon. So it's like here ish. Okay. Treasure of Awakening. Tunic of Awakening. Isn't this. So these, this is because it's a newer uh, amiibo set, I presume? Also, I haven't found the, the frog yet. Sensing for it says it's this direction. Not in this room, though. Hmm. That's annoying. It also doesn't say it's above or below, so I think it's near closer to the entrance. So that's where I came from. Did I not go into this room? Is that what the problem was? There we go. A little annoying. 